All right, this is Prism Football 2-Box Break number 2, Tiered Random Teams. I'm going to post number 3 right after I do this randomizer during the trade window. So we'll go 7 times. Remember preset combos. If you're gonna trade a uh, if you're gonna trade a team, you have to trade the whole block of teams. And we randomize both the tiers and the list of customer names, just like a normal random team break. So we're gonna go seven times: one, two, three, four, five. Depends where, Sean. Six and seven. If it's like a face tattoo, we'll talk. But anywhere else. Probably don't want to see it. No offense. <laughs> Seven times on the uh, team names. One, two, three, four. Just not my style. Five, six, and seven. Or maybe we're one of those companies that don't hire people with tattoos. Although, I think we have a few people with tattoos, so. It had to be a new rule. Yeah, come on, Sean. Face tat. Wow, Sean, Cardinals, Falcons, Dolphins, Cohen, Giants, Browns, Texans, Aaron, 49ers, Ravens, Chargers, Nicholas, Redskins, Rams, Bucks, AJ, Jags, Eagles, Bears, Jets. Actually, pretty good one. Rolando, Raiders, Bills, Vikings, Tyler, Patriots, Steelers, Lions, Seahawks, Titans, Packers, Ryan, Broncos, Bengals, Colts, Aaron, Cowboys, Chiefs, Panthers, Saints. So remember, you have to trade the whole block if you want to trade. But I will pause the video, post the next one. All right, no trades. Everyone kept their blocks. A couple, uh, couple of offers, but no cigar. Um, did I post the next one? No, I didn't, did I? Uh, we're in Hermosa Beach, California, about 15 minutes or so south of uh, Los Angeles International Airport. The area called the South Bay. That's where we're located. We used to be in Redondo Beach, a little further south. But we opened our new store in... Um, we opened our new store about four or five months ago. Before all this crazy stuff happened. So we had to move locations. But. Yeah hopefully. Be back someday. Store. Jaspie's After After Dark. That's like when the Carson Daly show used to come on. After uh, David Letterman. And the other CBS guy. Maybe um, Craig Ferguson. Maybe I'm thinking of. Fun fact. Um, while I'm trying to find this link for Prism Football in case someone wants to buy out Prism Football. Um, David Letterman used to live in my old town in New York. would see him jogging on the, on the sidewalk all the time. Not even sidewalk. They didn't have sidewalks. Westchester County. So a little personal connection to... To Letterman, but yeah, it'd be like the Carson Daly after after show. You got some cards you want to sell, Sean? Are they sanitized? Yeah, no veteran base ship um, in this one, but all the silvers, all the rookies, inserts, ship of your team. Usually in football we don't. In basketball, when we say veteran based on ship, we'll always pull like, especially now because I think the six. Be sure if you've been joining breaks for a while, or even like the last couple years, and you know you've joined like basketball breaks, be sure to pull all of that LeBron, all those LeBron base that are going crazy right now. I would just sell it now. Get get you know fifteen twenty bucks for a base card. It's crazy. The 1213 Prism, if you've been collecting for a while, while. Breaking for a while. Uh, and there's Aaron. Sorry, there's Ricky Seals Jones. Little cut in it. That's 110 of 199. 
on. I think his 1213 prism is over like 150 bucks now for LeBron. All 1213 prism since it's the first year prism. Somehow people are just realizing that. And uh, cards are going nuts. 44 of 249, Jarvis Landry. Same with all the Bulls, of course. There's Haskins. Nice. Sleeve all the big rookies, too. Like I said, don't know what Joe pulled in the first two boxes, but the next two boxes are in the store. 43 of 149, Mohamed Sanu. Don't think it was anything too crazy because I would have gotten a picture. It was a Kyler Murray Silver or something. Some cray cray. There's our first auto. It is Taylor Rapp Silver Auto for the Rams. That's going out to the Los Angeles Rams. Sorry, once again, this is a tiered break. The teams aren't randomized, so it might take me a minute. Nick, I know everyone's probably like trying to go to bed. Well, maybe not. I'm usually up at this hour anyway. George Kittle. There's Byron Murphy to 175. That's why I was like, might as well be on the clock. I haven't been able to sleep very well. Might as well uh, get a little distracting going on. A little distraction breaking. Might as well be on the clock if I'm going to be up. There's Zach Allen Silver, Cardinals. And there is Karan Higdon to 199. Yeah, 330 over on the East Coast, yeah. Trey Quan Smith to 249, although unless you're an essential worker. Does it even, you know, sleep? Overrated. Dante Pettis is 75. Daniel Jones, base rookie. Okay, that's in a sleeve. So we've got a cracked ice, some sort of purple X Fractor. It is Juju Smith Schuster, 26 of 49, the USC Trojan turn stealer. Schuster. Also a popular YouTuber with the youth. The youth loves Juju. And there's 20 of 30, Debo Samuel. Nice relic auto there. Um, Emmanuel Sanders, or not Emmanuel Sanders, he's gone already. Marquis uh, Goodwin is on the trading block, so Debo might have a bigger role next year. A little bit of corner wear on the bottom left. That's for the 49ers, Aaron Pettit. Sells really well. I think we picked up a gold patch auto, and we had it in the Big Hit Express. I think it could, that one from Select out of 10 went for like over close to 200 bucks. So 49ers, they like to collect their cards. There's Kevin Byard. 99 Tennessee Titans and Quadri Allison silver auto third auto of the box for the Atlanta Falcons that was probably the team with the Cardinals maybe yeah Sean Corbett gets the Quadri Allison um, I think it's mostly Prism Optic, Rex. Sorry, I just saw that. Mostly Prism Optic. Especially like 1617, which is the first year of Optic, I believe. And 1213 Prism. But any, pretty much any LeBron. I mean, I'm sure any LeBron is selling well. But yeah, if it's something from like Donruss, I don't know. The market right now but I mean I guess eventually right look at all the Jordan cards now even like from the junk wax era in the 90s all those cards are going off right now has anyone take taken a look at Ken Griffey jr. I believe his 19 I always forget the year 1989 upper deck the iconic card whatever year that is 
the PSA 10 version of that, I think, has gone from like $700 a couple weeks ago to over $1,500 now. I don't know why. I guess it's just so many people who are coming back to collect who grew up in that era in the 90s. Late 80s, early 90s. And it's just growing so popular. It's just really crazy. It's hard to keep track. But yeah, we always pull like the LeBrons and usually sleeve them. So if you're hesitant on joining an NBA mixer because of that, don't worry, we'll, we'll pull the LeBrons for you. Mahomes, insert, Miles Boyk in a 199. But yeah, I'm in a Prism Sports Cards group on Facebook, and it's got so many new members coming in every day. Prism's definitely the, uh, the hottest brand right now. There's Dre Greenlaw. Auto. Yeah, I know. I'm also in a sports car dealer Facebook page. And they said a lot of the 90s boxes for basketball are going way up in price. Stuff that was like, you know, considered junk is now sort of sellable for a lot of dealers. We never really had any of that inventory just because we have start we started, you know, in 2014. So we didn't have a ton of inventory. The 249 Frank Gore. But some of these shops, you know, have had that stuff since the 90s. So I'm glad that it's, you know, finally kind of sellable for those people. Get it off the books after 20 years. Evan Ingram to 175. Alshon Hype, there's Tariq Cohen Blue Wave to 199. Yeah, Tom Brady, because you don't know how long he'll play with the uh, with the Bucks. Who knows? He might just win a Super Bowl and be done. You know, I don't think he has to honor his full what's it, a two year? I'm sure he will, but Travis Homer Silver. And they might be Kyle Fuller to two forty nine for the Bears. They might be the first team to play. I mean, I don't think the Bear, the Bucks are going to go to the Super Bowl necessarily, but they could be the first team ever to play in the host city. The Super Bowl is in Tampa Bay this year. They might be the first ever team to play in it. Uh, breakthrough, James Conner while hosting it. Marvin Jones to 49. Mecole Hardman and Dwayne Haskins again. And yeah, prison football rookies, base, you know, Locke, Murray, are all doing pretty well too. Paris Campbell to 149. That's crazy, that earthquake. Uh, Bobby Wagner, there's Brett Rippey and wrong Broncos quarterback. Come on. Although, right behind him. Uh, to 99. Not a parallel, but a nice Drew Lock. I think these are like 20 bucks, to be honest. Not sure if I'm right on that. Uh, Ryan with that one. Could be this Redemption? I don't know. He's a notorious Redemptioner. Deontay Thompson to 175. Arizona. And Josh Reynolds, sensational signatures. Might be a force with the Rams because they don't have too many playmakers now. Uh, Nick, are there two top ones, really, other than Robert Woods? Is uh, They're gone. All right, Redemption, last card of the break is... Rookie Autographs Prism Red, uh, Red Wave, David Montgomery. Arizona Cardinals... 
That is going out. Sorry. <laughs> Chicago Bears. That's going out to uh, AJ, right? Yeah, AJ. The Bears. I don't know why I said Cardinals. So there you go. That was the break. Thanks, everybody, for getting in. Prison Football 2-Box break number two in the books. Uh, the next one is in the store now, number three, if you guys want to run it back tonight. Uh, sell it out.